Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the series When Women Treat Men Like Kings. I ain't done this in like five months. We let's just get straight into it. Y'all losing me. Y'all losing me, man. Y'all losing me. Well, that man's happy right there. And I know most females are gonna see see that as oppression. Oh, you're doing this for your man, you're doing that for your man. She wants to do it. That's why she's he's happy doing it. But yo, even though your girl's treating you so good, man, don't put off going with your friends. Your boys were there before her. They'll probably be there after her if it doesn't work out. So don't, don't stop seeing your boys because of your female, man. Don't do that. Don't, don't be that guy. So I took you shopping, got you all this stuff, and you couldn't just buy me food? Deadass, if you did all this, you need to return everything. And then leave her there and let her just go ahead and just Uber home. It's not even worth it. She don't deserve none of that. Nothing. Not it. It's facts. It's facts. It's not facts. It's facts. It's not facts. A foolish woman treats her man like a slave and then becomes the slave's wife. Whereas a smart woman treats her man like a king and lives like a queen. But to be a king in the first place, a man should act like a man and not like a boy. Bro, this guy should run for president. My man just solved the whole world's issue in that like two minutes. I'm telling you, when a man and a woman are united, man, and they're both together, that's a very powerful thing. They don't want their nuclear family to exist. That's why all these agendas are going on. And that's why most women hate men and most men hate women, man. There's a divide going on, divide and conquer. But as a man, as he said, you have to be worthy of that treatment. You have to become your best version. And the woman will in turn treat you like that. But some guys are out there, are their best version. Or they're getting there and they're with a woman that's dragging them down, just being negative to them, etc., etc. You don't need that in your life, man. You know what I'm saying? You can do much better. You know those men who want to treat you like a queen and give you that princess treatment? Let's talk about what they look for in their women. Whenever I post videos of my boyfriend doing cute things for me, one of the questions I always get asked is what do you do for him? Men and women, they have different currencies when it comes to what they look for. High Valley women, they want that princess treatment and they want to be pursued. For men, all they really look for is a woman who supports them, respects them and makes them feel wanted. It's not looking for you to do a bunch of grand gestures in return. He's just looking for basic things you may think that it's really basic but in reality what is common knowledge is not what's common practice yo men are so simple man i don't understand it baffles me how females still don't understand men it really does men are so simple but there's a lot of agendas making them think other things and it's just weird man it's just weird Fool, y'all could watch a t money video without doing any push-ups get down and give me 10 right now pause the video and do 10 push-ups come on now we ain't got time for playing around you are not watching my videos and lying down you watching my videos and getting gains and getting a pump you feel me now, that's a wholesome video man but yo this video is kind of a metaphor for relationships the man runs the marathon of life. He has to become successful. He has to become financially good, physically good, etc., etc. And the woman's at the end of the marathon, waiting at the finish line. That, that, that's kind of a metaphor for life. I ain't gonna care for most relationships. Am I, am I lying? 